Hello Australia. Much has probably already been said about the new app being compulsory. I'm here to tell you that the app was compulsory, but it's not compulsory anymore. I mean, it was compulsory in the first place, and what we mean by it being compulsory is that it was compulsory, so that means it's now not compulsory. I mean, let's just call it what it is. It's a COVID ankle monitor. And the good news is that we are winning the war on the coronavirus. I mean, I got delivered this hat from the American president. Might try that out a little bit later on. He left me with a note that said, cease all funding to the WHO. Now, at the time, I didn't know what he meant by that. It just said the who. And I thought, what did I say, darling? I started singing, talking about my Jenny Morrison. Didn't I, hey? And what did you do? She's gone into the other room. Very nice, Mr. Speaker. But we all have to stay at home. I'm staying here at the lodge. I would like to be at one of my other homes, whether that's in Lilypilly or Kirribilli or Honolulu. I mean, we make do with what we've got. So all of the jigsaw puzzles are all finished now. I'm very proud of the girls and what they've been able to accomplish during this very difficult time. So instead, now Dad's been reading them fairy tales. This one here, Rapunzel, let down your hair. You've only got 30 minutes, hurry up. And this one here by Josh, another fairy tale. We have to stay at home. I'd like to go out and get a haircut, but instead, I have to just deal with my scum over. <laughs> Very nice, Mr. Speaker. I mean, I would prefer all Australian children to be at school. I mean, my girls are staying here at home. Now, unfortunately, they're being homeschooled by Pauline Hanson. They've been in the kitchen this afternoon cooking gollywogs. It's not a perfect world, but it works. And that's why my government, the Australian government, will pledge to send out jigsaw puzzles to all Australians and all Australian households, codenamed Operation Sovereign Boredom. Nobody will be left behind. The sooner that all Australians can go out, we can get back to watching the footy. Sharkies. Very nice, Mr Speaker. The good news is that supermarkets are replenishing. Essentials are returning. Pasta is returning. In fact, my favourite pasta is at my dinner table right now. Brian Houston is waiting for... Jenny, can you get him a cup of tea or something? Thirty-seven degrees. Any hotter, it'd probably be going off to Hawaii. So I say to all Australians, thank you, God bless you, and hang loose. Written and authorised by S. Morrison for the Sharkies Party Cronulla.